We've helped out with a uh, long-term nuisance problem up in the Panhandle region, northern Idaho. We've taken advantage of that by moving about 100 birds uh, from the Panhandle down here today to the Andreas Wildlife Management Area where we released them. He's right there! Oh, he's <laughs> the other thing we would like to do is try to inspire youth to be involved more in outdoor activities and get them involved with wildlife. So we invited a lot of kids out today to take part in this release. The legs were kind of like strong and stiff. You had to keep them together with your hand and then just kind of hug it like that. You could either just let it go in the ground or you could just count to three and toss it in the air. I love doing that. Those birds are big. You don't realize how big a turkey is till you see one up close and personal. Some were not reluctant at all to, to grab a turkey and let it go, and others were just willing to just pet one or just watch other people. But it's, it's an experience that these kids will remember. We try and get the kids involved in any way that we can, get them introduced to the wild turkeys, to how to hunt, to how to conserve our land, uh, you know, how to just get out in the elements and experience these things that a lot of people don't get to experience. So it, we make it a family effort. We've seen such a decline that it's nice to be able to bring some more down and release them today and hopefully have a, a good hatch this spring. A lot of kids are just delighted first time they've ever had the opportunity to be this close to a wild animal like this. It was awesome. You, you can like literally feel the force when the turkey takes off. It's like a huge rush of wind. It's cool. As part of any movement of animals throughout the state, we like to do some disease testing. So we've taken about 20-25% of the birds today. We've drawn some blood for them uh, and we'll take that to the lab and uh, just to ensure the health of the birds that we're not uh, moving diseased animals around. They oftentimes try and find if there's disease or test for genetics or different things like that depending on you know what we've had in the past that they need to look for. I released the first and the last turkey there was. It was just amazing. I saw a tremendous amount of enthusiasm, looks of awe and wonder. A few kids a little standoffish at first but very very curious and I think just about everybody wanted to gather around and get a closer look uh, at one of these birds under this real unique opportunity where you've got a live bird in hand and can see what it's all about. Awesome, it was fun.